Hey guys, uh, welcome to my uh, new playlist, uh, Love is Contagious, the live concert co-video series. Um, just want to give you a little welcome and uh, talk for a moment about this uh, big emergency that we're going through. Um, I've done my own research. Everybody has something to say about this, and some people believe the virus doesn't exist at all. Some people are in the opposite direction saying it's a lot worse than they, they say it is, and so on and so forth. Um, I, I imagine that the reality is somewhere in the middle. Um, I want to recommend, uh, first of all, a lot of you are connected with me through uh, James Corbett, and I highly recommend you stay with him on this. He's been keeping up to date, been very busy uh, producing videos uh, about uh, this emergency. Um, another uh, guy to keep an eye on, his name, he calls himself Dark Journalist, and uh, if you haven't checked out his videos, do. Uh, I'm not going to leave any links, uh, so just do a search on YouTube for the guy. Uh, very, very unique and informative videos regarding something called continuity of government. What this does is, when you talk about like the New World Order or the Illuminati or this stuff, it's a very vague idea, it's a vague floating idea, but this guy brings it down to concrete terms. Um, um, the military, there's a faction of the military who are just lusting after going for martial law. Um, and there is a, an emergency act called Continuity of Government that basically if um, Pence and uh, Trump get uh, terminated, either through the virus or whatever other means, um, there's a, a general by the name of O'Shaughnessy who will take over the United States government. And uh, at, the, at that point, when continuity of government checks in, um, the, the Constitution will be rendered null and void. So this is our worst nightmare. Any of you who are in the research community, alternative research community, know exactly what I'm talking about. This is their dream come true. Uh, it's great to watch uh, um, uh, Dark Journalist because, uh, not that it's not great to watch James, I mean, he's awesome. It's just I, I found a kind of unusual perspective coming from Dark Journalist in regards to that um, he's actually very positive about this whole thing. He, he hits you with a bunch of really kind of scary info, but you'll notice he'll stay calm and collective as, as he speaks, speaks and even humorous, you know. Um, so, uh, point being though, when he gets to the uh, long and short of it, they're overreaching. They're doing this way too fast, and uh, they will not deny our constitutional rights. There'll be too many scientific minds that are gonna say you guys are this is crazy you can't you can't take away our constitutional rights for this this is a gross exaggeration of what's going on also i recommend you check um any videos regarding this current thing uh, uh, uh that include dr paul cotrell c-o-t-t-r-e-l-l -L. he will explain uh, some of the from a very nerdy scientific viewpoint, he will explain why the virus is hitting certain sectors of the population, why pe some people get hit harder than others, um, and why it's possible to get reinfected according to him. Uh, these are all worthy uh, searches to do. Um, I recommend you do it because right now we're in an emergency situation, not because of the, the uh, virus going around, but because of uh, what they're about to try, what they're about to try to pull on us. Stay strong. I, I uh, want to talk real quick. I know fa Facebook is Satan itself, and you know, we all know it's, it, it's owned by the, the agencies, but you know, there's an advantage for me to be on Facebook because what I'm getting, I'm doing a live series of concerts on Facebook, I've done four of them so far, and I'm getting a tremendous amount of love from people. People have been tipping me in my PayPal account, which I need because, uh, you know, uh, I'm suffering through this financially. Um, so I just wanted to get that out, that uh, there's so much love going around that, you know, I, I find it so ironic that we're being isolated, and the more we're isolated, 
the more we feel connected to each other, the more love there is. So I have this powerful feeling that love is going to be the contagion that destroys what's going on right now. Uh, I've seen it, I'm old enough to have seen the whole movement of love in the 60s change everything in one big fell swoop. So it can happen again, and this time it can happen to a greater degree. So hang on to your hats, we're on for, you know, we're going for a big ride this next year, maybe really hell, but I guarantee you, we will prevail. We will prevail. Keep that in your hearts and minds. We will prevail. God bless you all. You know, I love you from the bottom of my heart. I think you're all true human beings, uh, and good luck to us. Signing off, enjoy the concert.